January 7, 1950. A fire engulfed the Mercy Hospital in Davenport, Iowa, resulting in one of the worst fires in the state's history. Around 2 a.m., a nurse found the St. Elizabeth's Mental Ward on fire. Over 60 female mental patients were trapped in the building. Most were incapable of rescuing themselves. Making matters worse, the windows were barred, making them impossible to escape and extremely difficult for fire workers to penetrate. Screams from the patients could be heard from outside the building, but firefighters could do little to save the women from their burning prison. The heat was too intense for the men to enter the building. Firemen stood on ladders, hacking frantically with axes at window gratings, but watched those inside disappear into the flames. One nurse died in her attempts to rescue patients. A total of 41 people died that night in the fire. Over 100 firefighters battled the fire for over four hours. Today, near the site where the 1950 fire claimed 41 victims is a small cemetery. 16 of the St. Elizabeth's victims are buried there. The fire was set from a self-committed patient, 23-year-old Eleonora Epperly. It is said she was angry that she was locked in her room. She lit the curtains on fire with a lighter. She claimed that she was in a panic because she believed her husband had died. She lit the fire and escaped at a window. Originally charged with murder, the young Epperly was described as being schizophrenic and was not held responsible for her actions. She was released to the care of her husband. Surviving patients of this tragedy were admitted to Forest Park Chiropractic Sanitarium. With Mercy Hospital now destroyed, Forest Park Chiropractic Sanitarium expanded to accommodate the influx of new patients. Because there were no other psychiatric facilities in the Quad Cities, an arrangement was made between Scott County, Forest Park, and local psychiatrists. Forest Park would provide custodial care for their patients while under treatment and become a licensed psychiatric hospital. Its name was changed to Davenport Psychopathic Hospital. Although patient numbers soared, the chiropractic care of the facility ceased. Forest Park was sold in 1959 to a Lutheran church affiliate and today is known as the Schutzen Park Place of the Good Samaritan Society.